Short form content is taking over the world with billions of people watching it every single day. Attention is becoming more and more important in today's society. It's the new biggest currency. Some few people have realized this and are making investment banker salaries with just simple short form video that take no more than 10 minutes to create. Just look around you. Everyone is creating TikToks, shorts, and Instagram reels. That's why in today's video, I'm going to show you the exact step-by-step -step to create these viral anime shorts. But why anime? Anime has a huge fan base. Therefore, more and more people are gonna watch your videos. More views equals more money. It's simple math. Just look at this channel that does his anime content with 500,000 subscribers and $10,000 estimated monthly earnings. Now please guys, open up your ears and focus so you can understand. Now let's start with the video. As always, I'm going to use ChatGPT to create the scripts for these videos. And since these channels all use scripts and quotes based on stoic philosophy, I'm instructing ChatGPT to create the script based on a stoic principle. It's always important to instruct ChatGPT to use modern and simple words and avoid hyperbolic language. And as you can see, ChatGPT generates five scripts you can use for your videos. Next, you want to create the voiceover. And if you don't want to have a voiceover sounding like Siri's annoying cousin, I'd recommend Eleven Lab. This is by far the most realistic voiceover software there is. And they have a free plan which gives you 20 minutes of voice generation a month. When you go to voices on the left side of the screen, you can browse through hundreds of unique voices and really pick one you think fits best with your videos. Next, you need to paste your script from ChatGPT to Eleven Labs, and you'll have your voice over ready. Let's start with the creation of these I generated anime videos for this. I'm going to use Pika, formerly known as Pika Labs. They have a free plan, which gives you 250 credits for free every month. And if you run out of these 250 credits, you get 30 credits a day extra until the next month. Now for the prompt, I'm going to use something like running by the river, working hard, making progress, dark ambient. And since we want it animated, I'm going to write Ghibili style anime, and I like it to look hand drawn so it can have a better feel to it. Now you are almost ready to add everything together, but before you can do this, you will need to download some background music. If you are going to use these videos on Instagram or TikTok, you can simply download the latest viral music. However, if you are going to use these as YouTube shorts, you want to use copyright free music. Epidemic Sound has the largest library of copyright free music. So that's always what I like to use. Now let's add everything together for this. You need an editing software, I recommend using CapCut simply because it's free and very user-friendly. But you can use every editing software you like. Now let's start. Start by uploading everything you've downloaded, then place the voiceover and the music on the editing timeline. You can cut off the rest of the background music by placing the timing bar at the right point in the editing timeline and hitting the split button. All right now, it's time to start adding the generated videos. But before you do this, you want to change the aspect ratio to 9 by 16 because we are making short form content now. Simply drag the right videos on the timeline and enlarge them so they cover the entire screen. Then you can adjust the placement so you get exactly what you want in the video. Now simply listen to the voiceover and pause where you want to switch up to the next video, then shorten the clip and drag the next next one onto the timeline again. Enlarge the video and adjust its placement when necessary. Now simply repeat these steps until you have the entire video done. You can also add simple transitions like pull in, glare, whoosh, and many more you can find in CapCut's library. Last thing you want to do is to add captions to your video, also known as subtitles. Around 40% of people who watch short form content do this with the sound off or on low volume. If you don't add captions, all these people won't watch your video, giving you almost no chance to go viral. Besides, captions are a great way to engage your viewers, which result in them watching the video longer, giving you even more chance to go viral. Especially if you are using animated captions like these. For this, I always like to use Submagic. This is an AI power tool which automatically transcribes your video and adds animated captions. You can use this program for free. However, I would recommend looking into a paid plan to unlock all features. So once you have signed up, you want to select create and upload the video you just created in CapCut. Then you want to select one of the 50 languages Submagic supports and select transcribe. And within seconds, you have these high quality animated captions here. You can then choose from a couple of viral pre-made caption templates like the Harrowy captions, the Mr. Beast style captions, and many more. Personally, I like the clean style of the Iman Godzi captions for these type of videos. If you scroll down a little, you can change the color size and position. If you select edit theme, you can actually change almost everything to create the exact style you want. Next, you want to check if the transcription is correct or if you need to make some manual adjustments. 
In this case, the transcription is already correct. Once you are done, select export in the top right corner and download your video and you are done. You can then upload your video to YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram Reels, and I'm sure you can get monetized in your first 10 video since these anime style video are going that much viral. Yes guys, that's pretty much it for the video. And if you found this video useful, share it to your friends. I would really appreciate if you guys subscribe to my channel, like the video, and turn on notifications for future videos. But before you go guys, I've recently uploaded a video showing you guys how to make these viral Disney Pixar animated shorts that I've been personally doing and have earned a lot from them. So click on the video so you don't miss out. That's pretty much it. I'm leaving. See you in the next one. Peace.